Hey everyone, I'm going to show you some socket programming with Python. We're going to create some Python scripts that will create a socket connection to send data on demand between two programs. You would do this between a server and a client device if you were developing something like a chat application or a stock ticker or an IoT device network, any system that needs to deliver data in real time with an always open connection. Here's the Python server script. It imports the native Python socket class, which creates a TCP socket object. It binds to my laptop's port 8080 and waits for a client to connect. When a client does connect, it sends a string to the client saying, I am server, then it closes the socket connection. So I would run this server program first and would wait for a client. Here's the client code. Open a socket connection with the server's address. Send some data saying, I am client, and then listen for some data from the server, which we saw earlier, it will say, I am server. This 4096 number is the maximum amount of bytes to receive from the server. I'm going to run the server program first in one terminal window, and now it's waiting for clients to connect. In another window, I'm going to run the client app. You can see here that it received a string from the server over the socket connection. And if I go back to the server window, we can see that the server received data from the client and then disconnected as planned. We can run this client app a bunch of times and the same thing will repeat. Now you will probably ask, how would I send data from client to client instead of client to server? Doing that is kind of tricky because not every client device will have a publicly accessible IP address like the server would. So what we can do is use PubNub to be the broker in the middle. PubNub has that publicly accessible IP address, which is at pubsub.pubnub.com, and it can route data from client to client. PubNub delivers data in generally around 80 milliseconds, so it's fast. And it makes sure that the data gets delivered to the right devices, whether it's one-to-one, one-to-many, or many-to-many. -many. It auto-scales to any load, all the good stuff. I can get my free account API keys at dashboard.pubnub.com and start up two client programs. This Python program uses the PubNub SDK, which can be installed with pip. I put in my publish and subscribe keys so the client can start that always on connection. When this is running, we can send or receive data at any time. The SDK takes care of threads, so the callbacks fire asynchronously. The program waits for terminal input so I can send strings on this channel, chan1, at any time. I can run a second instance of this program with a different device number here so you can see who is chatting. If I run this program anywhere on Earth, as long as there's an internet connection, all the devices will see this data in real time. I'm going to go to my terminal and run the two programs and send some data back and forth over PubNub. And you can see that both devices get the messages instantly. You can sign up for your free PubNub account at dashboard.pubnub.com. Thanks for watching.